Welcome to Sakintos. It's a tender port. Let's go and explore. This fantastic boat will take you on a tour around the island, including the Blue Caves. It will take about four hours. Or, if you prefer, you can just go on this electric train around the town. Sakintos is famous for its beaches. The nearest one to the port is a shingle beach, but the water is very clear. The Capeta Capeta great sea turtle is a protected species here. If you walk along from the shingle beach, you'll come to a sand beach and a lovely little cafe where you can have a beer or a coffee. Dionysius Solomus is a famous Greek poet who wrote Ode to Liberty, which became the Greek national anthem. This is Solomon Square, a great place to start a stroll or a good meeting point. The Church of St Nicholas on the Mole at the edge of Solomon Square is the only Venetian church to survive the earthquake in 1953. It was built in 1561 and is dedicated to St Nicholas, patron saint of seamen. A great way to see this island is on a scooter and a few hundred yards up from the square you'll find a place where you can rent one. As always we like to do a comparison value on our fridge magnets and here the fridge magnets are very nice and one euro, one euro fifty and two euros. St Mark's Roman Catholic Church is at the top of St Mark's Square, another very picturesque square beyond Solomon Square. Just to the side of St Mark's Square is another church dedicated to St Nicholas. At the southern end of the harbour is St Dionysius's monastery and church, which is dedicated to the island's patron saint. Like we said before, is a copy of the bell tower. The bell tower is a copy of that of St Mark's Square in Venice. Behind the church are the cloisters and the ecclesiastical museum. The Church of St Mary the Virgin was built in 1633. This is the queue for the tender. 